Right, well I had the boat safety test or examination the other day and it's passed now but it did fail initially on a few little points. First of all we had to put a um, oil restraint in there. I mean it, you can put a drip tray in but there's no room underneath my engine for a drip tray so we had to put some ply in there to um, isolate any potential oil leaks etc. It uh, also failed on these battery clamps um, because the wires are held down by screws and not a spreader plate so they had to be changed and the power cable for the offshore power there's a grommet in there of some kind to clamp the outer sheath of the wire and that wasn't actually on so the wire here was loose and I put some tape around to keep out any moisture as well. So apart from those points everything was fine so that's good for another four years.